opens for the summer, but major problems plagued its opening last year. You might remember angering both visitors and the park's neighbors, but this uh, families, but this time families will see some noticeable changes. NBC Charlotte's Brandon Goldner live near the park's entrance. Okay, Brandon, what can we expect this year? Well, Fred, perhaps the biggest changes is right before you actually enter the park, this traffic light on Nance Road that leads into the park. It caused a lot of traffic issues when there wasn't a light there. Homeowners, though, near the park also have some of their own changes. It's one of the last afternoons of peace and calm on Nance Road before the summer crowds. <laughs> When Ramsey Creek Park's beach opened last year for the first time in decades, cars congested the road, people packed its sidewalks, neighboring homeowners were exasperated. We didn't necessarily have the infrastructure in place to uh, handle all of this uh, traffic. This year, everyone is prepared. Homeowners in this neighborhood place these cones to prevent beach visitors from parking on their street. Mecklenburg County Superintendent of Park Operations Greg Clemmer says they've enhanced the area to make life easier for both visitors and homeowners. They've installed new surveillance cameras, added 50 new parking spots, and decided to continue a cat's shuttle to the park. We're trying to work with neighbors, and I think we've worked up to come to a solution to that. And so we're looking forward to a very smooth operation. And we'll truly see if it will be a smooth operation this Saturday when the park opens at 10 a.m. Reporting live, I'm Brandon Goldner, NBC Charlotte. Where's Biden McQueen? That's the only thing I want to All right, we're here in lovely downtown.